a Jeremy Vine panelist, has stated that Prince Harry's involvement with Netflix is an embarrassment as the Sussexes face growing pressure to sever ties with the streaming giant due to the upcoming season of The Crown. Princess Diana's close friend Jemima Khan was drafted in to help as an advisor for the fifth season but announced that she had left the project due to its disrespectful approach to Diana's final years. In a debate on Jeremy Vine this morning, James Max said it was totally unacceptable for Harry to have signed the deal with Netflix in the first place. The radio presenter said, he never should have done the deal with Netflix in the first place and he shouldn't have done it for several reasons. The first is that he knew the crown was being made and he kind of brushed it off because there were already stories coming out about the portrayal and whether it was right. The second thing is that the only reason he got a deal with Netflix is because of who he was and that I think is totally unacceptable. And the third thing point is that his company is set to make documentaries, feature films, scripted shows, and children's programs of which he has zero experience. I just think the whole thing is an abomination, it undermines the royal family as an institution, it puts the institution in a very difficult place and I think it's an embarrassment on him and his wife. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex signed the multi-million pound deal with Netflix in September 2020, with Harry later stating that it was finalized in order to provide financial security for their family. Estimated to be worth over 100 million, the couple will produce a range of informative and uplifting content. At the time, the Sussexes said, our focus will be on creating content that informs but also gives hope. As new parents, making inspirational family programming is also important to us. Their first two projects have already been announced, with Harry set to produce the docu-series Heart of Invictus and Meghan to executive produce the children's animated series Pearl. The fifth season of Emmy-winning show The Crown is expected to arrive on Netflix in November 2022. However, its most recent series has faced criticism due to reports of its portrayal of Princess Diana. With Australian actress Elizabeth Debicki playing Diana, and Dominic West taking the role of Prince Charles, the series is expected to focus on the breakdown of the couple's marriage. Don't miss over the weekend, Jemima Khan, a former close friend to the Princess of Wales, told the Sunday Times that she had backed out of helping the new series of The Crown and had asked for her name to be scrubbed from the credits. She had been asked by creator Peter Morgan to assist with the episodes concerning Diana's final years, but said, when our co-writing agreement was not honored, and when I realized that particular storyline would not necessarily be told as respectfully or compassionately as I had hoped, I requested that all my contributions be removed from the series and I declined a credit. Princess Diana sadly died in August 1997 alongside her partner Dodi Fayed. The couple had visited Paris and were being chased by paparazzi, with their vehicle eventually losing control, 